Sambal Madura. Sambal. Sambal. And good morning. This is my first video not on Java Island. We came over, just crossed over the bridge and came over to Madura. We are starting off with some rice right here, a Madura specialty. It is kind of like a, a huge holiday. We're going to learn more about later, but. I'm excited. We're going to get in here, eat a few breakfasts, and then we're going to go into the village and hang out with some local people. It's going to be a good one today. Ooh. Uh, it's a town called the Skip Jack. This is what you want to do here. This Clams. This is a town called Sambal. So you see what she's got here? She's got her rice right here. It looks like she's almost out for the day. And then she's got the skipjack. You can see clams over here. Sambal. Rorasin. Itu maaf ya, Bu. Iya, ada apa-apa, ada apa-apa. Namanya nasi serbang ini, nasi khas Madura. Enak ini. Cellophane noodles, some tofu. Ini kerang. Kerang. Alhamdulillah. Oh, we're done. Nope. No problem. We are cool right here. She said she got like 50 more packs ready to go. Change it out. We'll get our plate. And you can see we got all these banana leaves down here. It's what the actual skipjack was cooked in, mixed with very aromatic ingredients. It's like shallot, chili, I'm sure ginger, turmeric, a few other things to get that color. Oh, and everybody showed up. We got one, two, three, four, five. We got like six people just hanging out here. Yeah. It's amazing. People just surrounding her right here. She's been selling for 20 years. Really set up a stall and a following. I mean, there's about like eight or so people just surrounded around her. But look at it. Look what we got here. Oh, look at this. You can see like the little tiny fish in that cracker right here. Can y'all see that? So it's almost like been a batter that's been fried and it's got a little tiny little fish in there. That's gonna be delicious. I've seen it with the prawn. I haven't seen it with the fish before. Toasted coconut, that tofu. Actually has cow skin in there as well. Clams, cellophane noodles, and that skipjack. Let's give this one a bite. And this is like an uh, original dish of Madura as well. And you can see the table over here. It's so far away from her. Yeah, she's selling over here. We're way over here. Okay, let's give this a bite. I don't know whether to lay it on the table or to like hold it in my hand. I kind of feel like, yeah, I love it. Caress it. Keep it close to you and just like hold on to it. I haven't had any clams really while in Indonesia. So I'm going to get a little cracker, a little coconut, clam, and the Madura Sambal. Sorry, I keep rolling my R's. Madura Sambal. so nice to get over here in East Java because it's when you get over here the the flavors really change it's been a lot of sweetness in our travels throughout Java but you get here and it's spicy it's pungent a little bit funky it's flavorful briny salty it's everything but sweetness and I'm, I'm really enjoying that especially after having been through Java where it is so sweet the new flavor profile is really just hitting home for my taste buds I don't know if you can see the rice or not, but it's also different. It's called nasi punel, and so it's got a higher starch content. It reminds me of like a japonica style rice. A little shorter grain, a little starch here, sticks together more. It's so delicious, so sweet, so nutty. It's so intense of a flavor by itself. That was delicious. That just hit my taste buds and everything, and it's this little play right here. So hard not to go by. Let's keep it moving. Bye-bye. And two seconds away 
from our other location. We're here for Nasi Patis. Patis is, uh, if you haven't seen the other videos and you may not know, it is the fermented shrimp paste of Indonesia. Uh, we're also going to get a Soto Madura. So the type of Soto that's special to this area. And how could you miss this building? I mean, look at that bright color. <laughs> wow. It is vibrant, neon. But then it's simple. You walk in here, it's just like a good hometown eatery. Oh, look at all types of nasi here. Nasi champur, nasi rolong. But we're gonna get the soto, probably no nasi, because we're gonna get the nasi with the patis as well. But he wrote, he wrote the order right there, that's funny. Wow, all about vibrant colors here, from the neon green to the yellow. <laughs> it's done already. Can you see the table? They just wipe it down, so no more order. But here it is, nasi. Petis. I guess this is gonna be a sambal patis right here. We got an egg. Yeah, sauce right there. Look at the thickness of that coconut. That looks good. And then we got a little soto here. Just gonna test it while we're here since I've had every other variety while in Indonesia, it feels like. Look, I see. Simple sauce, beef, cellophane noodle. And actually it's somewhere like a salt sambal is what they call it. Whoa. Mm. And I see why wow, a little of that sambal goes a long way. It is spicy, it is dry, it is salty, enhances the flavor of everything. But the thing that got me is the sauce over the egg and the beef is like cheesy. <laughs> you hit it like a brick. Nan Paul, it's like fried beef jerky. Before I go any further with this, though, I want to try the soto. What happened with everywhere we go? It's like everybody's following us. It is. It's full in here right now. Like it was literally empty when we just walked in two seconds ago. Lime, sambal, not too much because I just want to try what they've made here. It's such a light breakfast broth to me because it's made with a lot of meat, not much bone at all. You can see by how clear it is. Almost like a garlicky scallion chai flavor coming through. It's nice. This is something like, if I didn't want to eat much in the morning, I would get, but after having so much flavor, it's not quite what I'm looking for right now. And this is more like it. We're here, we're here at a home in the village of Madura. We're gonna go check out the kitchen right now. I can hear nasi kapel. Oh, lots of cooking going on here. Salam pagi. Look at this. Everything's going to be wood fire. Just kind of like an outside kitchen going on here. <laughs> oh, we're cleaning the chickens, what we're doing. Ayam kampung. Ayam kampung? Ayam kampung. Yeah. And they've cleaned it out. You can see the feathers hang here. She's going to keep be feathering it. She's going to take out the innards. Oh, they already have right here. So she's going to keep washing it. And we're going to get that cooking going. But look. Kambing. Mm. So you got all their goats over here. I guess they raise goats here. Hi, guy. Hey guy. Hello. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> you like foreigner? You like foreigner? I have no food, though. I have no food. I'm sorry. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. What have you done? What have you done? Can you get in? Can you get back? Can you get back? Turn. 
Turn. There you go. He was stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this kitchen. So traditional. So she's gonna make a. Is she gonna make bubur manis? Bubur manis, yeah. Okay. So it's, uh, several types, eating with uh, santan mm. and the palm sugar syrup. Right. So we'll cook this down. It will thicken up a lot. And right here, it's like sambal. I think that's just going to be a paste they're going to use to cook the chicken in, not the sambal. Hello. 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 Wow. So scared. <laughs> I do. A little scared. <laughs> it's okay. I'm a scary person. I look like a lion. Chat mix. Chat mix. Coba ini. Kelapa. Es kobu. It's a young coconut with ajula gula jawa. Gula are. Gula madura. Not gula jawa. Gula are. Gula are. Oh, so that's going to be the palm sugar from this island. Yes. So not gula jawa, yeah. <laughs> gula madura. Gula sugar, you say like gula jawa would be like palm sugar from Java and now we got the gula madura. Gula madura is from aren, aren type of uh, aren, uh, aren palm. And some young coconut. Young coconut, coconut water and gula madura. Oh, I love that. Deep, dark, rich, almost a little bit smoky, not too sweet. Then with the coconut water and the actual meat of the coconut, very refreshing. I actually like that because the food's been so spicy and pungent. It's nice to have that little sweet, refreshing drink. Maybe one of my favorite drinks I've had in Indonesia. Really? Yes. Mm. Oh, grilled chicken. <laughs> so here they got the palm sugar. We'll eat this with the bubur. You can see right here, see? When they, she was first cooking it, just how like runny it was. And now look. Mix that flour and just solidify it up. And then we'll eat it with this. They may have some tapioca or something we'll put with it as well. And there goes another chicken. Yeah, ini Kampong. Mantap. Mantap. Just spread it out, man. <laughs> <laughs> Spread its legs, lay it on the fire. Yes. 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 <laughs> the funniest part is when you like come to these places and you know they're like joking like with you and about you but you don't understand. You just gotta smile and go with it. <laughs> So it looks like a hickama, pineapple, some gula. Oh, I actually got gula that's like in its. I'm gonna shut up and just watch. Look at that, it looks like they've almost got a caramel already. Got some chili in there. I had some water because it can't yes. can't work it. It's so so hard to work. Yeah, Oh, here goes the chicken. Gotta balance it just right. Gotta get every little 
part of it grilled up, crisp up. Oh, here come more chilies. Ini Okay. Beautiful consistency to it though. It's a little runnier than a caramel. It's beautiful. It's not too sweet. Uh, Maybe if I just get an actual little chili on there. Hey, mm. Now you sweat a little bit when you eat that. Or it could be this fire over here, I don't know. <laughs> oh, <my top. laughs> oh. Oh. oh, I just smashed my head. Oh, too tall. <laughs> I just smashed my head yeah. walking through the ceiling. The turn here is because you're done. Oh. You just got your dog. Watch, Hold on. I almost knocked myself out. <laughs> wow. This is Ooh. This is nasi, but here they call it nasi kapal. Kapal is the motion of like uh, pressing cake like this, pressing the rice like this, so almost like a rice cake. In, uh, inside the banana leaf. This is a uh, special nasi, nasi kapal. Yes. Is this krupuk udon? Yeah. The best krupuk. <laughs> I like mine with a little green on them. Oh, this is the bite right here. This is what I live for in Indonesia. So good. Hey, host. Hey, host. Ayo. Ayo, celup tangannya. Bismillah. Bismillah. Gini. Oh, ya. Ya, cara Ah, Bismillah. So you're going to take a little water, take a ball, dip it. Ayamnya suwe suwe. Ya, nanti ayamnya digigit. Coba di tiket. Sedap. Ayamnya gimana? Itu. Satunya, bos. Ayo, mas sama juga nih. Pull off the head. Ya, cuci tangan dulu, bos. Bos, cuci tangan, bos. Cuci tangan, bos. Yeah, I will. I haven't touched the rice yet, don't worry. Yes. I know. Sudah mudah. I think I don't know. Kalau pakai sendok, dah enak, bos. You must oh, use hand there. Yeah. I know. Well, huh? No sand. Wow, look like a boy. 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 Wow, look like a Ini ya. 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 This is so good. So the rice is actually really starchy. You've got to wet your hands just a little bit because it sticks so much. Then you can kind of just... I kind of almost use like my eating rice method, take off a little bit. And you got to kind of just like work it a little bit until you make it into a nice little ball. Compress it just a little bit. I'm a little messier than most people, but for the first time eating like this, not bad. Tadi lah sudah madu. Pulang mau naik kapal dari. Dia tahu dia belum pernah. Ini telur goreng. Telur rebus. 
Taylor rebus. Rebus. To twice actually. Boil first. Uh huh. And then fry. And then they fry. So yeah. that's rebus. Is boil and fry. Rebus goreng. Yeah. Okay. Rebus goreng sayur three times. <laughs> three times. Yeah. That's <laughs> why they put in the broth. A lot of work for an egg. Mm. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> kalau makanan Madura begini di luar Madura susah. Iya. Cuma ada kalau sate, soto kan. Iya. Kalau yang asli begini Arab. harus di sini datang. Iya. Yeah. Itu bumbunya namanya bumbu. This type of rice. Atun. Not curry. So these are used a lot for celebration. They uh. Well, we're using them to take the dishes away, but when you got a lot of people, you can kind of dish plates up and either bring it to the people. I guess it works for taking it away, too. I just woke up, took a 20 minute nap. I got this set on me. I got the bubur manis with coconut rice flour, just a little coconut sauce, palm sugar, and little tapioca jellies. Check it out, Madura special. Okay. We're gonna get on the road. Uh, you film me, I film you. Sami Sami. Sami Sami. Not Sami Sami, what is it? Now one of the best parts, we're doing it the old way, we go to Surabaya, we're on a ferry. That's right. So we're gonna head back to Surabaya. Now I'm gonna check into a very expensive haunted hotel. We'll see you at the next one. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it.